nigga poppin' with a pocket full of cottage. Yeah. Whoa, chemo, stop it, chop up, aim it, get your like it. What's up guys, your boy Darkskin, and today we're going to be talking about each person's individual jutsus. Now, I know um, in my last video I was talking about, um, I was talking about, you know, what their, like, pictures show. This one was like the Flying Rising Tandem Bomb, and this one was Shinzu Senju Veritable 1000 Hands, and this one was uh, Riku Shifu Siko Reno Dan Zero Shiki, um, but I didn't know for sure what everything was going to be for them, Right? But now, um, somebody actually sent me a video with, you know, the, like, with the Jutsus, right? It was data mined, actually. So we're going to go ahead and go over it. Now, before we get into it, um, some people are going to say, how do you know it's real or whatever the case may be. But the reason why we know it's real is because this video came out, like, October 19th. And it already had, um, like, Orochimaru, Jiraiya, and Harusen's Jutsus in there, which, if you look right here... Um, you can see that, right? So, we got Toad Oil Bombs, Ninja Art, Needle Jizo, Summoning, Bring Down the House. It already had all of Jiraiya's moves in there. And October 9th, I don't think all three of those were out. I only think, like, maybe one was out at the time. So, you get an idea of why we, we're pretty much trusting this source. Um, so here's Jiraiya's. Here's Harusen's Firestyle Dragon Flame Bomb. Earth style Earth Bullet, um, Reaper Death Seal, which these are all his Jutsus right here. Multiple Striking Shadow, Wind style Great Breach, Summoning Jutsu Ramp. Orochimaru just came out not too long ago, right? So, um, Snake Clone. So it has everything, even the Clone Jutsu. So that's why we believe it to be true. So. Uh, based off of what we already know about what he's already data mined, we can confirm that this is what's going to happen. So anyways, getting into it. All right, getting into everything. Hashirama Senju, Wood Style, Laughing Buddha, Jutsu. And this Jutsu, the user sends chakra into the ground and creates wooden hands that can be manipulated. When spawned at a target's feet, they cause damage. So, boom, that's the first one. Second, Wood Style, Wood Dragon, Jutsu. A jutsu where the user creates a huge dragon from a tree. The beast homes in on a target, lowering their ninjutsu use count on impact. It also boosts the secret technique gods for this jutsu. So pretty much, it boosts the secret technique, and it lowers their ninjutsu. So pretty much, it resets their chakra on the ninjutsu. Which, that's actually really, really cool. Really, really good. I like that. His ultimate. Sage Art Wood Style Shinzu Senju Veritable 1000 Arm Cannon and Chojo Kabutsu Artifacts of the Buddha. Now, I told y'all that man's juke ultimate was going to be Shinzu Senju Veritable 1000 Hands. I told y'all that. So, anyways, this jutsu uses Sage Jutsu and Wood Style Ninjutsu to create a massive Buddha which marches forward and assails the target with myriad strikes. Uh, pretty much the 1000 Hand Buddha statue or whatever he makes. Going on Tobirama, Water Style Water Dragon Jutsu. This Jutsu allows the user to create a flood of water in the shape of a dragon, which can pass through obstacles and strike a target, causing damage. All right, boom. You know, Hashirama, Tobirama, they both got dragons. In this form, the user fires a high pressure jet of water at a target. If it hits the ground, a geyser will erupt and do additional damage. Okay, that's actually pretty cool. And then his ultimate, which. We, we already confirmed what his ultimate was, right? Tandem Paper Bomb, which, for any of you that don't know, he does do Flying Raijin in, the, in it because he has to put the bombs on you and then he uses Flying Raijin to teleport out of the way. Just letting everybody know. A paper bomb that makes other, player, uh, other paper bombs appear before it explodes, creating carnage. Set in on the ground to create a trap. When a target approaches, it will set off, causing damage. So this is a trap? You don't throw it or put it on nobody? I don't know how I feel about that. If you, you don't actually put it on someone, it's a trap. So this is just giving defensive jutsu to a range type, in my opinion. Now... I know this is the one everybody been waiting for. I know y'all been waiting on this, so I'm going to go ahead and give it to y'all. 
Minato Namikaze, Flying Raijin Jutsu, a jutsu that allows the user to teleport, they throw a kunai, and then use the jutsu again to move to where it landed. That is so... The outplay on this is going to be crazy. Like, imagine flag battle. You throw a kunai, you run left. You throw a kunai right, right? You throw it right, and you run left, and then you teleport to the right side. Bro, like, this is going to be insane. I'm going to have to really get into a practice mode and test this out and try to see what I can come up with. Flying Raijin Level 2. A surprise attack that utilizes the Flying Raijin Jutsu, the user throws a kunai at a target. If it hits, they will teleport above their head and launch a Rasengan. Guys, I'm sorry, but Minato takes it. Minato has the best kit in the game. Minato has the best kit in the game. Like, those two alone are actually stupid. He can teleport wherever he wants. He can teleport to an enemy. Bro. And then his ult. It says Rosin Flash Super Circle Dance House Stage 3. But if you guys know, that translates to Shipu Senko, uh, Shipu Senko Renadan Zero Shiki. But anyways, a combo that utilizes transportation ninjutsu, the user charges forward uh, toward a target before throwing six kunai in a furious combo. Now, if you guys don't know what this is, this is when he throws all six of the um, kunai and he keeps teleporting to each kunai while comboing the hell out of you. That's what this move is. So, um, anyways, this is all of the leak. Well, all the data mine information. I'll have videos over Madara and all the others in the future that are coming out. And I'll probably make videos on them whenever they get, you know, scans and stuff like that. But, uh, yeah. So, anyways, um, that's going to be about it for this video. Be sure to give it a like, subscribe to the channel if you're new. Comment down below. Tell me what you guys think in the comment section below. With that being said, I'll see you guys next time. Peace.